Welcome to Code with Miracle channel. In last video, we learned membership operator in Notin. In this video, we are going to learn identity operator is Notis. Identity operator are used to determine whether a value is of a certain class or type. It can also be used to check whether both variable uses same memory location or not. Now let's see example. Here I have created a variable called x with value 5. Here in line number 14, I am trying to get the type of x. Let me run my program. Here you can see it written me type of class int. To check this in if condition, you have to write your code something like this. Let me uncomment this code. Here you have to use is, is operator type of x is int now let's try to run our code here you can see printed it is integer so this if condition is working fine now let me go into second example in this example i have created uh, two different variables a and b with a same value code with miracle now I am trying to run this with a is b. Now let's try to know the result. Here you can see it return true. It is because that a and b is using same memory location. To know the memory location of a variable, you can use uh, id of a, id of b. Here you can see both the variable A variable E use the same memory location. That's why it returned true. Now let's try the same example in list. Here I've created a variable X and Y. And I specified same value for both variable 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. Now let me run. Here you can see it returned false. It is because this condition applies only for string like if you have same value in string then it uses same memory location whereas for list it is quite different even though the value is same it will try to store them in a different memory location because it is uh, mutable that you can change the value of any memory location now let me give you another example say instead of doing this if i did z equal to x now if i try to do x is z in this case you can see that result would be true it is because if you try to assign the value which you got from a variable to another variable then Obviously, both variables would be pointing to same memory location. That's why it returned true. That's it for this video. If you haven't subscribed this channel, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.